Hi, uh, my name is Atul and I'm the head of alliances for a product unit called Digitate, which is part of Tata Consultancy Services. Digitate new uses Neo4j for our uh, graph database perspective. We are an AI product and for us, context play a very, very important role. Uh, when you look at any AI product and if you want to create the relationships and nodes around that and you want to represent the nodes and relationships, behavior and context play a very, very important role. While behavior is time varying, context is a lot more static. So for the context building models, we use Neo4j. Oh, Igneo is a beautiful AI product. Um, what more can I say about Igneo? It's a cognitive automation and think of um, any operations, be it IT operations, SAP operations, workload management, or any kind of operations, which is mostly human intensive. You have army of engineers in your data center, which manage your IT. Think of the same world without the IT engineers and there's an AI which can actually take care of that. Learn context, manage alert, give you smart alerts and triggers, give you smart recommendations. Doesn't just stop there. Can go and take action also autonomously and ensures your IT, your operations are up and running. As I told you, context is very, very important to us. And uh, when we looked at the whole thing, the moment our scale of node and relationship cross beyond a million, there were not too many relation databases available which could actually do that job. And when we looked at the overall scenario, the ease of working with Neo4j, the kind of features, availability, scalability, um, looking at the user community, Neo4j is the market leader in this particular space and that's why we went with Neo4j. I think the ease of handling Neo4j and the kind of results we achieved surprised us. Maybe because we were habitual to the relation databases and we didn't realize there is something available which can understand the relationships, dependencies, interdependencies, and could actually be so easy to handle too. One of the customer of ours, um, the issue over there was the bad jobs and the bad jobs kind of ran into millions. And each bad job, especially in a banking environment or a manufacturing, the relationships and dependencies are way too many. And before you could actually make a smart recommendation that this is the cause of failure, this is the probable cause of failure, and by the way, if this thing fails, how many other things would fail in a cascading effect? That's where a technology like Neo4j came in handy for us. Ours is a pure AI ops product, and we certainly believe the way world is going to, understanding the whole environment, understanding the business functionality, the dependency of business to IT, to any kind of relationship and every component in that particular business, the dependence of each other that if this fails, what else would fail? If this is not working and it is dependent on the VMs to the host, to the last possible network device, what should I focus on and how is it I can make things smarter? is where technologies like Neo4j would play a good role on that particular side of it and it has a great future in the AIOps side.